What's up guys, today we are going to be checking out the future of water physics in video games. So welcome to Fluid Flux. This is like a uh, hyper-realistic water simulation plugin, I guess you would call it. I'm not sure the technical term, but this is kind of like a, a dev tool here in Unreal Engine 5. And look at this, dude. Look at how the water's finding the path of least resistance, moving in, filling up all these little holes and... and cubbies and everything and making its way downhill the debris falling with it look at the debris getting caught in these little uh, vortexes here before continuing to make its way oh gosh dude this this is insane this is truly the future of video games this is is what we get to look forward to in the very near future look at this it's creating this little vortex waiting to fill up before it can spill out down here oh we've got a little a little turnstile thing so that's turning. This is all making its way downhill. I want to go check out what we've got going on on the other side. Ooh, okay. We've got a little boat here. That's going to start to float. So this all started with that little area up top, up in that top right corner. And now we can see slowly over time, I mean, the water's just filling in exactly where it would go in real life. Like this, this isn't a pre-programmed thing. This is actual physics. We're swimming around in it. Look how the ripples are. Dude, <laughs> This is wild. Can we dive? We can dive here. Look at the ripples on the surface of the water here. And the debris floating over our head. I want to go see this, this boat. Can we see the boat start to float? Looks like the water's got to pick it up. It's going to have to get up over these. Dude, this is seriously incredible. Think about the future of this. Think about, you know, GTA 6 or whatever other major games are coming out in the future. Think about the oceans of GTA and having something like this in there. Looks like the boat finally got dislodged here. Dude, this is wild. Slowly moving into this cave here. Let's see what's on the other side of this. Oh, we're, we're, we're bringing the boat out to the beach down here. She's kind of stuck. Can we, can we push? We could push, dude. Look at that. Real-time physics. The water is reacting to what we're doing. The boat's reacting to what we're doing. I'm going to move the front end. Then we can move the back end and maybe send this thing downstream. <laughs> Dislodge this bad boy. I'm going to try to... Ah, oh, we can't push it straight. I want to I want to send it with the bow forward, but it's all right. She's going to go in reverse. We need a little bit more water here. Try to push this front end and she... Can we, can we ride it, maybe? I don't know if we're allowed... Oh, we're in it. We're, we're kind of weighing it down, though. Now that the water's not doing as much. We have slow motion, too. We can slow everything down. Dude, look at the look at the little white water effects and everything. Dude, this... Look at that right there. That looks like you recorded that with a camera. Look at the, the little rainbow light refracting on the surface of the water. I don't even know the, the, the words for it, but this is gorgeous how the water interacts with the sand how it's a lot clearer up near our feet but then kind of slowly transfers into that blue as it gets deep oh our boat's loose this is truly incredible dude look at it, it the, the the river is bringing the boat down through here it's going around this rock right here so this current is pushing the boat it's following that now it's probably going to start moving over to the left got kind of a, a rip current action happening here look at that Look at the movement of the water. This, I've never seen anything like this. So I'm going to link the creator's YouTube channel down in the description. It's Imaginary Blend. I guess this is a, a plugin that he made for Unreal Engine 5 that like game developers can, can purchase the rights to to be able to use with this hyper-realistic water. And he had a, a demo that was free to download. I just kind of wanted to check it out. I just, I love the idea of the future of video games and, and getting little sneak peeks here. And this is, this is truly one of them. I, I kind of want to jump in. We can ragdoll too. Let's jump. Ragdoll. <laughs> Bit of a shallow landing. I could watch this all day. I mean, this this is seriously incredible. Look at all these little currents and things happening. Look at the water making its way around this rock. Could go right and left. Right is definitely the, the more common path, but not all the water can make it out there. So some of it's coming down this left side. Can see our two liter bottles floating down there. Somebody did not do a good job recycling. My goodness, so many beach balls and two liters out here. And we're we're just flowing. It's just going. Like we're we're gonna try to swim upstream here. This this never ending block of water here is just not not letting up. This is a deeper part. Let's ragdoll into this. Oh my goodness, dude. That is so sick. I'm gonna go back up top. I'm gonna ragdoll right here at the start. And I wanna see I wanna see what happens. So ragdolling, we're gonna make our way into this current and off we go <laughs> running into the rocks and stuff it might be a little bit too shallow here yeah it's not gonna carry us i'll help us out a little bit we'll move over this way just gonna let the waves 
take us wherever they want. I'm at their mercy. Kind of slowing down a little bit, but then we hit these little currents. <laughs> Dude, this is amazing. I, th this truly is the future. Th this is... I, I've... I'm blown away. I don't even know what to say because I'm blown away. Left the river and now we're headed out for a beach day, baby. We've got the ocean. Look at the size of these waves, dude. This is, this is incredible. Look how good this looks. Do a little dive down. See what we've got going on under here. Look at like all the little god rays and things. Oh, the surface of the water looks insane. You can even make out the, the you know, mountains off in the distance and stuff. Deep blue beyond of who knows what's down here. Man, he, if he wanted to put a jump scare in here, now would be a really good time for it. Looks like we might have broken to the other side of the map, so we're, we're going to go back here. Yeah, it's, it's meant to be more like this, but wow. Oh, we've got fish. Look at all the little fish and stuff swimming around. Obviously, that's not the, the focus of this. we got another boat over here. Like, the assets themselves. This boat doesn't really look that good. The fish don't really look that good. Even, like, the, the rocks don't. They're not super highly detailed. The point is to watch the physics at work here. Look at the, the the way the box moves, the way the water's manipulating the box, the way all these little beach balls and stuff are bouncing around. I don't know who put this much plastic in the ocean, but I'm not happy about it. The way the water interacts with the rocks here. This is the best water I have ever seen in a video game period. It's not even close. Let's go for a little jump and a ragdoll. <laughs> Just gonna let the, the ocean do what it wants with me. Knock me out against the boat. Now we're stuck underneath the boat. Yep, it's a bad day for us. Waves are bringing us into the beach. Oh, man. Just gonna get clobbered up here. Think about if you went to the beach and you just laid down right there. This is exactly what would happen. The waves would be thrashing you around like this. Oh my goodness, this is amazing. You've got the trash on the surface just moving back and forth with the waves, but then look at down here. It's all moving with the motion of the ocean and the, the currents underneath the water. So you've got stuff happening up top that's different than what's happening down here. If we go limp, our body's just, it's, it's gonna be pulled back and forth all over the place. I guess we kind of tend to float up towards the surface. I guess we're holding our breath or something definitely have to have air in us to, to float like that but yeah look at this look look at the way we're we're all just being ragdolled around all these currents are at work the currents are moving around this giant pile of sand down here i mean th this is this is truly miraculous look at the cross waves that are happening all the waves coming in bouncing off the rocks coming back out Oh, this, this would be a rough day at the beach that's for sure gonna go see what we've got going on down here dude i mean this this map in and of itself is just <laughs> this is so stunning, dude. Oh, the leaves blowing in the wind up there. I mean, that's not as spectacular as everything else we have going on, but still pretty cool. Just have more fish over here. And a heavy drop off into the deep abyss. Last map to check out here is we're on an island at sunset. Just us on our own little private island here. I guess we could go check out the water and different lighting conditions. Oh yeah, this is this is a lot spookier. I don't like this as much. Look, I love the surface of the water and the way it reflects and refracts and wow. You can even see how the sun is coming through and shining on the sides of the f dude this when something like this is applied to major it just I my mind is absolutely blown. Oh, we've got another body here. That's concerning. That is, I, I'll go, I'll go limp with you. We can go limp together. This is like you and your friend being stupid in a pool or something. You know what I mean? Hold on. I'll, I'll, I'll get over close to you, dude. All right. We're, we're just going to let the, let the ocean take us for what it wants. But think about like GTA six. I, I keep saying GTA because I just, I think about GTA five and like the ocean was so cool. The fact that you could just jump off the pier and go into the ocean and swim around. And there, there really wasn't a whole lot to do in the ocean. But think about if we had an ocean like this in GTA six where you could, venture out into it and use your submarines and i'm so excited for the future of video games things are happening so fast the ai videos we've done where we've been able to talk to npcs and and they can understand us and respond and and hold full conversations and have memories and stuff and you think about adding that to stuff like this like the future of gaming is is truly unbelievable like we we are on the cusp of something great and i'm i'm excited to see where it goes so hope you guys enjoyed the video thank you guys so much for watching I want to check out some more Unreal Engine 5 demos in the future. If you guys have any ideas, let me know down in the comments. But uh, this is insane. I'll see you guys later.